the first half of the early new sale haul which is clothes should be up already and this is books and toys but I'm going to mention the cups again because I don't know quite which category they fall into they were in the clothes bag so I mentioned them in the other one but they're technically not clothes so I bought four cups for a pound and then my mum bought Peppa and George I'm not sure how much they were but they do go which makes everything better so they are a favourite of Sophie and when I tried to take them to do the haul she started telling me off so we have George and Peppa at the moment and we will have to give them back soon then we've got five cheapy chirpy chicks and as you go through oh, two pages at once you get less chicks so there's less chicks on every page until at the end they all go to bed yes they all go to bed so that one's been quite enjoyed but that one was in my bag so it's a little bit sticky feeling don't put books in your bag because they get a bit sticky feeling um, and then there's the same with the wiggly wiggly caterpillars wiggly wiggly caterpillars and it's the same set out and the caterpillars go and at the end of the book they turn into butterflies and they are by Debbie Tarbett for caterpillar books and then as I said before that that we're going to do potty training so this is Princess Polly's potty and whenever you get to certain bits in the book the book cheers so we're reading that with Sophie at the moment in the hope that's one of the toys <laughs> in the hope that she'll just learn to potty train herself really um, and then mum bought some Fifi books we have a selection big band night can we have our ball back and a violet's big bracelet so they were there's three of them I don't know how much the books were because most of them were bought by mum I know that the princess potty one should be 6 99 but it was two and then we have the tiger who came to tea and my husband doesn't read very much as a hobby he doesn't in what well, yeah he doesn't enjoy reading it's not something that he would go to to do and when we showed him this book that we bought this book he went i remember that i used to read that book so I feel like really, like I've achieved something. We have a book that he remembers from his childhood. Um, again, that's meant to be five ninety nine new, and I would imagine that it was about a pound, pound fifty. Then for Ben, I saw this, and I thought that's small and can fit all sorts of places and in handbag. And I'm really sorry about my chipped nail varnish. I tried to take it off, but it's glitter and it just wouldn't come off. So I need to get some more industrial strength nail varnish remover um but yeah this was really cool and was 50p so that came home with us this was also 50p and it's a bumblebee on one side and a lady birdie type thing on the other with little crinkly wings and teethy bits on the side and he likes that a lot and to be honest so do i it's got a rattle in it too and then the last thing was this it's got little fabric numbers up to five and then they've got things on the back I think there's shapes on the back and it comes on this and I think you could probably hook it onto something uh, but it was new it had the cardboard on it we just took the cardboard off when Ben wanted to play with it so that was good that was about a pound and that was it for the books and toys I hope you've enjoyed it. Bye.